In just a few hours, President Donald Trump will be in downtown Manchester and he will be greeted by thousands of people waiting to see him. Just to support the president. I mean, he needs all the support he can get. You know, we're the only ones who do support him. Armed with tents, sleeping bags, and lots of rain gear, many people camped out overnight. I got about three layers on right now, wearing some polypro underneath this, have an extra set of uh, pants in my bag, bunch of food. Oh, we're in it for the long haul. And it's not just people from New Hampshire. Many traveled from out of state. We are avid supporters for a variety of reasons, and even though the weather is not cooperating, we felt it was kind of a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and we just want to show our support. We're very grateful for all he's done. I love what he's done for the country. This is the first time, the last two years, it's the first time we've had a raise in our pension in about 10 years, my husband and I, so we're really excited at that. The president's last Manchester rally was back in August. It filled the arena with 11,000 fans. And as with the last rally, there will be several street closures. There will also be rolling closures to allow the president's motorcade to get to and from the arena, a moment these people are waiting for. He's for the working man, and his policies are helping the working man. So, you know, I'm in favor of it. Thankfully, people here won't have to wait too much longer to get inside. Doors open at 3, and this exciting rally starts at 7. Reporting live this noon from Manchester, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9. All right.